it's another great day over here, everybody. I hope you guys are well. I just wanted to come do a few things and check on my painting from yesterday. So let's have a look at it. Yeah, yeah, that painting. It is still actually wet. Like it's still not like sloppy wet, but it's like, it's not even dry yet. It's, it's acrylic. It's been here all night. It's awesome, it's awesome stuff. Did I tell you how excited I am about the whole acrylic non-drying thing? I just want to talk about that for a minute. Or maybe I should just do a quick demo. That would, I think that would be more exciting. I'm not going to do a full demo, but a quick demo that'll get you started. What do you think? Yeah? Okay. Okay, so the first thing that I'm going to do, I don't have a wireless microphone on, so hopefully you can hear me okay. First thing I'm gonna do is I have our golden open thinner, as it's called here. This all, all this stuff came in the actual golden open landscape set. I didn't have to buy it separately. It was in there. All right, so we have our thinner. Obviously we have our, this is all open, golden open product. We have titanium white. And just for the purpose of this real fast demo, um, ultramarine blue. Just those three colors. And this is the, once again, these are the colors that come in the set. All right, so I have this palette paper right here real quick, okay? I'm just gonna do this right quick, boom. All right, just a little bit of white there. A little bit of white, thinner, okay? You probably can't see that too good. It's, a, it's just about the same size pile as the white, okay? All right, just for, let's do this. Let's put some blue right there. All right, out of the way. <coughs> okay, <clears throat> I just have a fan brush. It's easy, whatever. You can use whatever you want. All right, so I have this thinner that I'm, I'm just mixing this white paint in and it's definitely, it's definitely getting nice and thin, see? All right, so I've mixed both piles together. You see this? It's nice and thin. It's actually the consistency of liquid white, if that uh, helps anybody. Okay, I'm gonna move the palette paper just out of the way, okay? I'm going to, I'm just taking that white paint that we thinned down. I'm just gonna do a section here. I'm not gonna do the whole canvas. I'm just scooping up all of this white here. And I'm just spreading this around. Here, you see my finger? Well, it's focused back here, but watch, look, boop. The old fingerprint, fingerprint test. I don't know. Just trying to show you. It's a thin amount. Okay, so I'm going to, I'm going back over here. You can see a little bit. I'm just getting some of this blue. See this onto the fan brush? Boom. And I'm just going to go like this. I'm going to start getting some of this blue color on here in a little circle. This is just a, this is not going to be a nice painting or anything, guys. All right, boom. All right, boom, you see that? I got my blue right there. I'm gonna actually wipe this off on a paper towel. If I had a clean brush right here, I probably would just grab it. And then I'm going to, I'm going to like, almost like blend, blend this color down to the bottom. Well, it might be the top, depending on how I put the video up. This might be the bottom or this might be the top. So I'm going from, I want it to be lighter, you know, like when you go to the horizon area, you want it to be nice and light, okay? So I'm just working down here a little bit, and then I can come back up here and drag some of this color like this. All right, I'm gonna continue to wipe this off on a paper towel, just because it's the easiest thing to do right now, because I want that dark blue color off of the fan brush, so I can come back in here and essentially just blend this, you see? Just picture this being a sky, and like I said, I don't know if this is top or bottom on the screen yet, but just picture, you know, starting here in the top corner of a canvas and then working your way down. You guys all know this, and you want it to get lighter and lighter as it goes, okay? I actually do have this little baby blender brush, so look, 
Watch this. I could softly just come in here, you know, just to get these little, little lines out and stuff. But I'm not too worried about this right now. I don't want this to be a part of the demo. You can definitely blend this with a one inch brush, two inch, whatever, all right? But the, the idea is the paint is wet. All right, I'm gonna set that out of the way real quick. I'm going to just use the fan brush. I'm gonna take the fan brush. Now I'm going into direct white paint, straight up white, and I'm gonna make a cloud, all right? So I'm loading my brush up just like I do with oil. See, load the brush, and then let's go here. Flip the brush over just to make a little cloud, watch. See that, boom, just like this. Work it different ways, all right. Put some back here just for the heck of it. Okay, let me set the fan brush down. Now I have, I happen to have this little mop blender softer brush here. So that's when I'll start here and I'll soften out. I'm just going to soften the bottom of this cloud right here. Soften it up. Just drop it right, you know, bring it right down into the sky. Just like this. See? See that? The idea here is not about how to make a cloud. The idea is this paint right here is gonna stay wet for at least 45 minutes or an hour. And like I showed you earlier that I came in and the paint was still wet from yesterday. It was actually still wet from, from yesterday. Total shocker. All right. See, you could just blend and have a, you know, kind of relax and you could look if you wanna take a spot of the cloud up here Anyway, this isn't a lesson, but you get it, right? You could just do, do all kinds of stuff. You know, if you wanted to come back in and add another little layer, you could do that, see? Look, see, put the paint in, all right? See, look, same thing, come on the bottom, blend it, blend it, blend it. Pull some paint down here like this. You know, and just kind of work it around, work it around. All right? So, well, I mean, I don't know. Tell me what you think. Let me know in the comments below. I get so excited about this stuff, and you guys already know this, but I'm just so happy that I'm, that I'm able to come here and I'm able to do stuff every single day. I'm happy every, every single day that I just wake up and that I'm breathing. Today is just, every day is such a good day, and I hope that you guys understand what that means when you wake up. Tomorrow when you wake up, just be happy. Don't be, don't be miserable, you know, don't, don't let things get to you. Just enjoy the moment that you, you know, you're alive, you're here, you have another day to do something, create something or go somewhere, just do stuff and just, you can, you can really be happy. And I just, I forgot to put an ending on this video. So I'm recording it now while I'm doing the edit. And I just want you guys to know, I love all you guys. I hope everybody stays happy, positive. Just be happy to be alive. It's a, it's a good time to be alive. God bless you guys. I'll see you soon for a full video, a little bit more of a little detailed type of a video. So I hope you guys enjoy all this stuff. Let me know in the comments below if you want me to still just make videos like this, and I will be glad to assist each and every one of you. Take care. God bless.